Right, it's raining still, so I'm not going to be working the patio. Let me just turn on the lights. Right, so it's raining still. And I've returned the lawnmower. He's a good person, good neighbour. Don't want to steal from my neighbour. So I was thinking about what should I do next, and I've had this engine in my junk box for a long time. Um, never been able to get it going, so I thought I'd just give it a go. It's not in best condition, covered in muck and crap. I'm going to have to clean her up. Um, oil. Um, not a lot of oil. And fuel. As dry as a baby. Spark plug, just to check it. I'm sure I checked it this before, like about a year ago. Oh, it's, it's filthy, so I'm just gonna give that a tidy, well, clean up and get rid of all that carbon. I'm just undoing this bolt and then I should be able to take the air filter off and get access to the carburetor. Oh no, oh dear, I just broke something. Oh yes, just to take the carburetor off. That is what I think I broke, this bit in there, plastic thing. Bummer. Sometimes it's all about using the wrong tools for the right job. Luckily, I love the smell of WD-40. Daddy, chill. Oh, that's really stiff. So we'll take that up, take that out, open it up, see what's wrong with it. Filthy. So I thought that's all bent. Filthy. Filthy in there. Well, first of all, I'll just clean up this bit. This back on. There goes my 10 mil <laughs> socket, never to be seen again. Okay. 
color. Look how close that is to the edge. Check the new oil level. So just got to attach the spark plug. The exhaust isn't on, but I don't think that should make a difference. Turn that kill switch on. What can I say, ladies and gentlemen? I am getting good at fixing little motors. All right, put the air filter. Just gonna put that on. Um, Good. Seems to be leaking fuel. Ladies and gentlemen, I have found the problem for why it is now leaking fuel. It's because this is broken off of this. So, it's been raining fuel all day long. Alright, I'm just going to try and remove that. So, just draining fuel out into here. Um, because it's leaking out the top. Shame I put so much in. Uh, so we need to find a new fuel tank. Or we'll fix that fuel tank. So I managed to get this little broken screw out with the fuel filter. Just by using a punch and just punching it around. So now... I need to go find something which looks like that. So now we've taped it, no, not taped it, tapped it, got a new uh, thing magic on it. So we should be able to just attach it all again. And yes, it's working with no issues. Next. 